Over the past year, we've seen several Canadian families struggle for funding to get their children what's been called the world's most expensive drug. A family in Maple has joined their ranks, but with double the reason. They have twin girls who both need the costly treatment. Here's our health reporter, Pauline Chan. Even if they won a major lottery, Kim song Sov and her husband Nori Lai Chun might not have enough to cover their daughter's life-saving medication. The twins, Stephanie? Tiffany and Stephanie, have spinal muscular atrophy, or SMA. The condition often claims the lives of children before the age of two, affecting their mobility, their digestion, and eventually their breathing. It just sit only just 50 seconds or one minute, they can fall down easily. And they cannot move even the toy. The family has begun a GoFundMe campaign for Zolgensma, but with a price tag of almost $3 million Canadian times two, the family is reaching out for help. It's very hard for us as a family to raise $5.6 million and we are far away for, we are very far away to reach our goal. Right now, the 29-month-old girls are getting spinal injections of Spinraza, which will slow but not halt the progression of SMA. The girls are eligible to use Zolgensma only while they are under 21 kilograms. It's a race for time that Canadians have seen several times in recent months. There's nothing that would cause SMA to be more frequent now than it has been in the past. But we are doing a better job, number one, of diagnosing these children. Plus, new treatments have only recently become available, giving families a reason to seek public attention and funding. And this is why we're so excited about this billion-dollar um, announcement that the um, federal government made two years ago to set up a rare disease drug uh, strategy. Durhan Wong Rieger hopes they'll have a proposal on the table by the end of the spring, but in the meantime, children like Tiffany and Stephanie can only appeal to the Ministry of Health for funding of Zolgensma on a case-by-case -case basis. I feel like... My heart I'm is hoping. broken and I saw my kid, I'm so pity them and I really want to get the slogan smart for them so much. Pauline Chan, CTV News.